Hey family, welcome to Swift Intuitions. If this is your first time on my channel, go ahead, like, and subscribe. Let's get into this energy, what spirit wants us to know. Messages of clarity and truth, spirit. What should our family know at this time? Messages of clarity and truth. Right now, family, it says freak in the morning, freak in the evening. There's somebody that is desiring you sexually at this time. Um, I feel like this is somebody that is going to sleep, watching your pictures, uh, trying to create a moment with you. Somebody is trying to manifest you up in a sexual uh, way because they see you as the jackpot. It's something about uh, whatever you're displaying around you from your social media to the way you carry yourself, um, maybe the things that you are starting to receive. Um, you, you have energy around you of people are lusting over you at this time, Swift family. Uh, also, this is a, a energy of something very abundant is coming your way. So be prepared. A lot of you guys already know it, but I feel like money is going to be just falling from the sky. It's going to seem like every which way or direction you turn, you're going to be blessed and um, just showered with, with so much abundance. And this abundance is going to bring in a lot of attention, a lot of people who who are going to want to be with you for your resources or whatever it is that they feel that they can get from you. Right now, uh, Collective, I do see um, somebody is in their head about you. I feel like this is somebody that's in their head about you because they could have ne ne neglected you for, from the past because, uh, because they felt that somebody else was the jackpot. So... Swift family, basically, somebody is, is lusting over you because since you have been separated or or since they last started really focusing in on you, uh, it's something about your, your abundance that has grown. I feel like somebody is in their head about you or they are going to be very much trapped in their head about you uh, moving forward in the near future because um, uh, because it was something that they missed out on. It's like if someone could have chose someone else over you, they chose the other person because they felt that the other person had more resources than you. And it was a thing of the look of it, like how things look. This person was very surface, materialistic, and um, it's like they chose Chuck E. Cheese coins over real gold because they thought that the Chuck E. Cheese coins were real gold until they realized that you were being processed and shined up and you were the real thing. It says, let me ease your mind. Somebody wants to come in and I get an energy of seduction, seducing. Somebody wants to hook up. It's more like a string along situation. This person doesn't want anything serious. It's just that they see an opportunity. This is an opportunist right now. They want things to go in their favor, especially with this jackpot energy and and right now i feel like if you were giving this person energy in the past you are no longer doing that it says i told lies about what really happened so now this brings me to the past this is somebody that you could have gave your time to and maybe they were so stuck in this materialistic energy that they looked over the diamond and the rough and 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 it's like an energy of let me lie about a situation so that they can look like they were more than what they were. This person was very insecure in their ways. They would say things to their friends and family who were shitty. <laughs> yeah, it's like staying in the energy of unwise counsel. And this person would 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 talk about the people that they they encountered, the ones who they felt were financially set, stable. Well, like, look at what I got. Look at who I got. Oh, yeah, this person may have felt like uh, it, it's, it, it's like this person individual could have talked down on you uh, around the ones that they felt safe around and um and, and and let's just say when the energy had moved, when you no longer gave this person your energy, it's like they lied about certain things, your characteristics. Now that now that all of this abundance is on you, I feel like their lies are catching up with them and the people that they told have continually and still is watching you. This person is in their head about you. This person was very ungrateful. They did not appreciate what you brought to the to the table. They surround themselves with a lot of uh, envious females energy or it could have been an envious female as well. Messages of clarity and truth. 
I see right now with this uh this person wanted to this person wanted to keep you put you in a third party situation. They did not want people to know about you. It's because of the type of life or the type of person that you was wasn't going to balance with the type of people that they were around. I feel like they were around a lot of low vibrational negative deceptive snakes and you were this being of light, someone that was encouraging, someone that was always speaking positivity and they knew that that you and their world wasn't going to mix. So what they did was they lied to their world about you and they put you at a distance, hoping that you will always want to tag along like a stray fucking dog. And now this energy of let's keep it on the hush, this person still wants to have dealings with you, but they feel like it will they will be judged if someone or their family members found out about the love that they do have for you. But the truth is their family members already know their family members are very low, very low light beings. Messages of clarity and truth. Most high, when it's dealing with my swift family, why is freaking the morning, freaking the evening here? Somebody wants to come in and have some type of sexual healing with you with this temperance card. They want to... Um, they want to soothe things over, but they feel like the only, the way this person works is through their sexual energy. And also if this was someone that you've had encounters with in the past, they, they gained power from you through your sexual activities that you had together, which this is one of the things that this person is hoping that if they're able to accomplish with you, uh, conquering your body or temple, then things would change for them, especially when it's dealing with you because you're in the energy of really focusing on yourself. Let me ease your mind. This person is trying to be strong to see if they are even capable of fulfilling uh, a sought after assignment, which was to come in and to destroy you. Because the thing is, when this person has been in the dark so much and they uh, and they experience the light. When you, when your eyes are accustomed to seeing low dim images, when the light comes in, it's painful because now not only do you see the dirt and the shit that you've been rolling in, but you have to adjust your eyes to this newfound light or ability to see things more clear. This person did not want to see the filth that they were in. This person did not want to see clearer because they were comfortable in the darkness, in the dim, in the night. And now for them wanting to come and ease your mind, they're trying to be strong, not knowing if they're going to be able to stand the light. Messages of clarity and truth. What is this jackpot spirit? This jackpot, somebody wants to come in and work with you now. Why? Because they feel like you have you have more to offer them now. This person is selfish. This person is for themselves. And they still have not healed from a lot of things. The reason why they're still chasing um, this illusion. I feel like this person does have some type of feelings and emotions for you. This person knows that you guys had a connection, but the truth is collective at this point in time, I feel like you have moved on and now they are reaching for a connection that is no longer connected to you. Messages of clarity. I told lies about what really happened. This person said when you solely walked away, because this person was lying on you anyway, they were making it seem like you were nothing. They, they were talking to their family and their friends like you were just another notch on their block, on their a check off the, 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 their list. But the truth was like they had to lie about it because they talked about you in such a damning way. And when you finally pulled their back, it was the energy of, oh yeah, uh, Swift family not going nowhere. Yeah, I got them sprung. Yeah, uh, oh yeah, they they don't they're not living the life. They're broke. They're this. They're that. And they made it seem as if you were going to be straying along, following them. But when you left them, then they had to come up with other lies and illusions to put in front of those people that they value their opinion on in their face because it's like they brought attention your way, family. 
And then when they realize that you were no longer paying any attention to them, but you started elevating those same people that they were saying, oh yeah, well, you know, so-and-so look like they doing good. So-and-so look like they elevating. You still talk to so-and-so? Oh no, I had to cut them to the side. They were doing too much or something like that. It's like they brought attention on them by talking shit to you, but the people they were talking shit to about you continue to watch you. They continue to see you, bro. And now when the now when they come in, hey, you still talk to so and so because so and so looking good on their Instagram, so and so looking good on their Snapchat, so and so looking good on this and that. I've seen them in real life. You know they really they really about that. They don't need filters and shit. And then now this person had to come up with lies so it could feel like they were still on top in my head about you. They're in their head about you because you have become so stable. You have become so focused. You have become so grounded. You have become so abundant. This person is trying to come in really fast. This person is trying to see how can they work, how can they come in fast uh, to present you an offer that you are going to accept. Let's keep it on a hush. And in the same sense, this person knows that you are self-sufficient. You don't need them. They know that you're guarded. This person is coming in very quietly. They're not telling, see, they used to talk so much, not to you, of course, but to those that they seek approval from who are weak as fuck. And now this person is coming towards you in silence, not telling the people in the past on that they're wanting to work on a situation. They're wanting to come into union with you because of the past. They're not telling people that because they're not sure if they're going to be able to succeed. So now they want to be quiet. Now they want to come in making things work out with out letting people know because once if you win you turn this person down then that's going to be another fail under their badge see because if you accept them then then it's easy for them to go back and talk say yeah i still talk to them yeah we got like this you see so right now this person is coming towards you to see if they can still get that bragging rights because they know they are out of out of line and you're out of their league I love you, family. Love yourself. Remember, we are the gods, and there's nothing they can do about it. Blessings.